how are you doing? It's Alan here from Look For Warriors. And I want to ask you to do something today. It's really, really simple. It's really, really simple. And this message is going out to kind of young people who are going through school or coming out of school right now. It's a different world today. It's a completely different world than it was when I grew up. When I was growing up, I wanted to build on the internet because it was so exciting. The whole internet was so exciting. It was all starting off. And it was, you could tell it was gonna be a huge thing. And it was all freedom, complete free market. And it was very exciting for me to learn how to build websites on the internet and, and build, learn programming and do different things on the internet. That kind of set me off on my path. But it's a completely different world now. Completely different world. At that time, you put your CV up in job sites and hope that someone saw it. It's no good now. Just too much competition. You're basically competing from every with everybody in the world today. And you have to set yourself apart. Now, whatever you want to do with your life, that's your choice. I don't know what that is. But you have to set yourself apart. And the way today that you self, set yourself apart is you put your talents onto YouTube or BitChute or whatever you want to put it. But let's face it, YouTube is the main place today. So you set up your own website, register your own domain if, if you can. But whatever you learn, whatever you learn, and this might not apply to what you're learning in school, but I'm talking about specialized knowledge. We talked before about applied specialized knowledge. Now how you apply it is you put it onto YouTube. So it's really simple. See it, do it, teach it is the way to learn something. See it, do it, teach it. it used to be called grammar logic rhetoric. It's now called see it, do it, teach it. Really simple. You, if you're reading a book, if you read any books, if you don't read books, that's fine too. Doesn't matter. Do any courses. Do any audible books. Even learn something from YouTube. You watch it or read it. That's the see it bit. Do it. You take your notes. Understand what it's saying. Apply it to the knowledge you already have. And teach it. You put it back out onto YouTube. And the advantage of this is just two, a whole bunch of different advantages to this. Number one. You're learning public speaking, which is the one main skill that you need to know. You need to know how to public speak, how to speak up in a meeting, how to speak up in, if you're just out with people, if you want to get your ideas across, if you want to sell at any time, selling is very, very important. But public speaking is something that you're gonna to need to know. So, advantage one, you're learning public speaking. Now the first time you do it, it's gonna be terrible. It's gonna be absolutely terrible. I remember the very first video I did, I was doing a course with a guy called Sam Crowley. He was the everyday Saturday guy, great guy, great guy. And after, when the course, the course is great. When the course is finished, he asked for some video testimonials and I liked Sam, so I wanted to do a video testimonial for him and I did it and it was so terrible. I don't think he ever even looked at it. It was so terrible. And, but it was the first step. And this might not be perfect either, but every day I'm learning, I'm getting better and better and better. My public speaking is getting better and you need your public speaking to get better every day. So it's gonna be really bad the first time you do it. So the first advantage is you're learning public speaking. The second advantage is you need to bed down your knowledge. So you follow the system of see it, do it, teach it. The last part of that is teach it. So when you're putting the knowledge back out in there into the world, if you do a YouTube video, I do YouTube videos and sometimes I get a hundred views and I'm delighted about that because if I did a speech and a hundred people were there, I'd be, that'd be amazing. Um, but sometimes I get seven people watching a video. <laughs> sometimes I get seven people. And that's not the point. Now, maybe you're watching this in a year or two time, years or two's time when I have thousands and thousands and you're going, what are you talking about? You get thousands of views. But at the time of making this video, sometimes I could get seven people watching. But it's not the point. The amount of people watching isn't the point. 
you know, maybe it doesn't come up in search or whatever, you know. But the amount of people watching isn't the point. The point is doing it. Doing it. So there's a couple of things I'm achieving with this. I'm improving my public speaking skill. Number two, I am, and you may say it's not perfect. No, that's absolutely fine, but it's getting better. I can guarantee it's getting better every day that you can't argue with. Maybe. <laughs> Valleys and troughs for sure. But over time, it's definitely getting better and better and better. And I'm betting down the knowledge, which is really, really important. If you want to know, do, have you noticed that you learn things in school and 10 years later, maybe it's not 10 years after your schooling, but it could be a week later, you forget it, especially today with so many distractions. You've forgotten everything you've learned. You've got to learn it until the exam, then you can just forget it all. But that's with real knowledge, that's no good. It's no good just learning until the exam. With real knowledge, you need to remember and retain. Now I'm talking about if you're learning Photoshop, if you're learning Dreamweaver, if you're learning programming, if you're learning JavaScript, PHP, whatever happens to be Swift. Real knowledge, how to sell. If you're learning that specialized applied knowledge, you need to remember, you need to retain. And the way you retain is by teaching someone else. The way I heard John Taylor Gallo before talk about the school system, and he, he was saying the school system was really, really cheap because they didn't use teachers. The teacher was a facilitator, but the older kids always taught the younger kids because that's it helps the younger kids by learning off the older kids, but also the older kids learn to bed down their knowledge by teaching the younger kids. The teacher was only a facilitator. So, you improve your public speaking skill, you bed down your knowledge, you're following the system of see it, do it, teach it. You're really learning and you're really gonna retain. And the last advantage, which is really, really important. Today, you at some stage, you're gonna be looking for a job or you're gonna be starting up a business or something. You're gonna to wanna to connect with other people in order to work with them for one reason or another. But for the vast majority of people will be looking for a job. Now you send your CV out there, even with a degree or whatever you have on it, it's out there with another 100,000 CVs. But if you send a video, if you can send a video, one video, talking about how you know the knowledge that you need to implement in that job, you stand right out. It's not even close. It's not even close. Number one, they've seen you. They've seen what your personality and temperament is, which is really important for a job. Your personality and temperament, what you'll get on with other people is really important for a job. If it's a sales job, they might want you to be a bit brash and, and rude. Uh, but for all jobs, they want you at least to get on with other people. So they want to see what kind of person you are. That comes through in the video. So it stands you right out from anyone else who's going, looking for a job. You... They can see you, they can see your temperament, they can see you understand. Anybody can put anything in a CV. But if you're teaching them how to do the elements of the job that they're looking for someone to fulfill, there's not even a comparison. It's You're so far ahead of everyone else. So far ahead of everyone else. And I guarantee you'll be the only one who sent the video in. Now, there's obviously sometimes there's jobs that are meant for someone. It's it's the um, someone's son or a relative who was in the company and they're just advertising that happens sometimes. You might not get those ones, but you're so far ahead of everyone else on every other job application. So put your knowledge out on the web through video on YouTube. It's so important now. It's going to put you so far ahead of everyone else so far ahead of everyone else and i'm not i'm being completely completely here i'm doing exactly what i'm saying you should do i'm putting my knowledge out there every day even just reading the book and reading think grow rich and i'm putting every thought i have about think grow rich out there but put your knowledge your skills and your personality out there on youtube and do it now do it before you need it because the first few are going to be terrible terrible but it gets better and better and better and you may be embarrassed in the first few and sometimes i watch some of my old stuff and i'm embarrassed i mean i mean all that maybe like two weeks ago <laughs> like how did i say that um but put your stuff out there 
it beds down your knowledge, it puts you so far ahead of everyone else. At some stage, you're going to be looking for a job. Put it all out there. Put it on YouTube and put it on your website and put it on BitChute or whatever else, Vimeo, whatever else you want to post. This has been Alan here from Look For Warriors. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. I love that.